another episode of You've Met Your Match, a football game show where teams compete against each other for cash prizes. I am your gracious host, Mr. Tsar, and today we have a very special contestant. But first, let me remind you of the rules. Each contestant will begin the game show by playing one match against the half-star club that this wheel will decide. And if they win, they will play one match against the one-star club that this wheel will decide. Each time a contestant wins a match, their next opponent difficulty will increase by half a star. But if they lose, their winning opponent replaces them and becomes the next contestant on You've Met Your Match. Contestants will receive 25,000 for beating a half-star team and every opponent they beat, their prize money doubles. So let's meet our first contestant of the episode. I have my lucky suspenders on and it is going to be the treble winning Manchester City, everybody. Manchester City. So Man City is the first contestant on You've Met Your Match in this episode and honestly, this team is looking solid, lads. With their new signings, I mean, it looks like they can win it all again this year. So let's spin that half-star club wheel and see if Manchester City can win their first $25,000 in phase one and advance to phase two. All right, Man City, who is going to be your first opponent in phase one of half-star club? It is going to be Drogheda United. It is Manchester City taking on Drogheda United in phase one. Honestly, I can't see Manchester City losing to Drogheda United, and I think they're going to absolutely dominate 3-2. It was close. It was close, but Manchester City, they win the 25,000 and they progress to phase two. But who is Manchester City going to play in phase two? They have an opportunity to win another 50,000. Remember, the prize money doubles, but they have to play a one-star club. Let's find that one-star opponent for Manchester City. It is going to be, it is going to be Dalian Pro. Man City versus Dalian Pro. The Chinese side, Dalian Pro, are the heavy underdogs here. Man City can win another 50,000 for a total of 75k if they beat Dalian Pro absolute dominant performance for Man City that is 75k in the bank for Man City and they're moving on to phase number three Man City in phase three has an opportunity to win a hundred thousand for a total of 175 25 in phase one 50 in phase two a hundred thousand in phase three let's find Man City's next opponent in phase three a one and a half star club the clubs are gonna start getting tighter and tighter and a little bit more difficult it is SPVGG Beirut from Germany. A German side. Spog? Beirut? Is that how you say? Is it Spog? I'm just gonna say SPVGG Beirut. It is Man City versus Beirut. Honestly, the early phases shouldn't be a problem for Manchester City whatsoever. They gotta beat Beirut. They play in the third division of German football. Here we go. Man City for 100k in a total of 175. It is Manchester City. They win in phase three. Now they have a total of 175,000 in prize money and they move on to phase four to face a two-star club. Looks like Manchester City has passed Manchester United in prize winnings. Let's go to the next phase. As City begins its journey in phase number four, they can win 200 grand here, guys, for a total of 375,000 in prize winnings. Remember, the money doubles every single phase. We actually haven't had anybody get past phase four. <laughs> Odds BK got to phase four, but they lost in phase four. Let's find Man City's opponent. Again, it shouldn't be a problem. Who is it going to be? It is going to be a Saudi Arabian side Al Khalij. Man City is gonna face Al Khalij for a chance to win 200,000. I wonder if Man City can be the first club to get to phase five. They should be. They should be able to beat Al Khalij, right? Yes. Yes. Man City beats Al Khalij. They win 200,000. They have a total of 375,000 in prize winnings. And they move on to phase number five. The first club ever. Phase five for Man City might have some competition here because there's some decent teams like Brescia and Spal and Cardiff City. You MLS teams are on here. Let's find out Man City's next opponent. Who is it going to be? Oh man, this is exciting. This is exciting. It is going to be is Brescia. Brescia versus Manchester City. Brescia is a Serie B team, lads, but I think Man City should still take care of business. They have an opportunity to win 400,000 against Brescia. If they win here, they will move on to phase six. Can Man City do it? Come on, City. Man City. Unstoppable. Absolutely unstoppable. They're moving on to phase six. And their total prize money is now up to 775,000. Things are getting spicy for City lads. They're into phase six and they're about to face a three star club. Three star clubs, there's a lot of good teams here. Toronto FC, Standard Liege, Luton Town is in here. Millwall, there's a lot of good teams. Let's find Man City's next opponent in phase six. Who is it going to be? It is going to be Austin FC from the MLS. Man City versus Austin FC. Can Man City get past phase? Phase six in Austin FC and get to phase seven. They have an opportunity to make 800,000 here. 
remember the prize money doubles let's find out man city versus austin fc can they continue yes they can oh my gosh man city is going to advance to phase number seven and their prize money is now one million five hundred and seventy five thousand this is unbelievable incredible run what are we witnessing here an unbelievable run by manchester city but their opponents are just gonna keep on getting harder and harder three and a half star clubs phase number seven a lot of good teams a lot of bundesliga teams like Werder bremen panathinaikos is in here from greece schalke is in here genoa dinamo zagreb sheffield united is in here can city win it can city win phase number seven let's find their opponent who is it gonna be <laughs> who is it gonna be it is going to be it is gonna be dinamo zagreb man city versus dinamo zagreb in phase number seven lads it is man city it is dinamo zagreb lads if man city win here they can bring their total prize winnings to three million one hundred and seventy five thousand and move on to phase eight to face four star clubs let's find out come on city come on city yes it is city oh my gosh man they're on a roll they're, they're like i don't think they're gonna lose i don't think they're gonna lose a single game man city wins again they win a bunch of money and they move on to phase number eight phase number eight for man city it is four star clubs the clubs are just gonna keep on getting harder and harder fenerbahce fulham psv wolfsburg river plate trabzonspor bologna lil is here from liga <coughs> excuse me galatasaray is here guys ajax who is it gonna be who is it gonna be for city phase number eight who are they facing they are going to face the dutch side pay sv this might be a decent matchup lads pay sv are capable of upsetting city they're definitely not the favorites but they can do it if man city wins though they will move on to phase nine to face a four and a half star club let's find out oh my gosh city's journey is definitely not coming to an end five nil oh my so city is moving on to phase nine and their total prize amount is now five million nine hundred and seventy five thousand unbelievable phase number nine four and a half star clubs who is city going to face uh it's juventus it's ac milan it's borussia dortmund it's leipzig it's arsenal let's find out this is gonna be the toughest matchup yet it is gonna be sevilla it is gonna be manchester city versus the spanish club sevilla a true test for city is city going to move on to phase number 10 where they have to play a five-star club or is Sevilla going to ruin their day? Let's find out. Is it City or is it Sevilla? Ah, it is Sevilla! <laughs> City go home. Sevilla upset City and ruined their day and Man City is going home. Man City's journey ends in phase number nine where they couldn't beat Sevilla with a total prize amount of 5,975,000. Okay, thank goodness that Manchester City's run has come to an end. I thought we're going to run out of money. <laughs> so is Sevilla the team that takes over in the next episode? You guys let me know down in the comments. Man City had a pretty good run and they did much better than Man United. Man United couldn't even win 200 grand. Thank you for joining another episode of You've Met Your Match. It looks like Man City met their match in Sevilla. I wonder who is going to be the next contestant. Is it going to be Sevilla? Is it going to be someone else? Comment down below. Please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Stay happy. Stay healthy. Take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And we are out. Peace. Peace.